the longing to break away is in Vishuddhi, Agna and Sahasra. If energies move into Vishuddhi, you can become enormously powerful. If energies move into Sahasra, simply you're ecstatic. Agna is called as the third eye. Once your energies touch Agna, you are intellectually realized. Third eye has been elaborately established as an energy form. Namaskaram Sadhguru. I started meditating ten years ago and after a few years, I could see my third eye, a perfect eyeball. Is it real or am I hallucinating? Now, uh, this needs to be understood. What is uh, referred to as a third eye is not necessarily another eye like this, okay? It is not. It is just that, you know, there are… Hmm, there are, okay. Um, in the pranic system, we talked about the seventy-two thousand nadis. These seventy-two thousand nadis have one hundred and fourteen important junction points in the body. Like you know, in this building, the electrical systems are running, there are many junction point where major meeting of connections are happening. There are 114 junction points in the body. Generally, these are referred to as chakras. The word chakra literally means a wheel. But these are not in the form of circles or wheels. They always meet in the form of a triangle. The nadis always meet in the form of a triangle. And the whole yogic system depends on what you do with them. So out of this 114, seven are held as a major junction points. So these are the seven chakras that everybody is normally talking about. They are in certain… located in certain parts of your body. These are Muladhara, Swadishthana, Manipuraka, Anahata, Vishuddhi, Agna, Sahasrata. Muladhara means the foundation. This is uh, a center which is physically or physiologically, it is located between your anal outlet and your genital organ. It's called the perineum medically. If your energies in, are dominant in your muladhara, food and sleep will be the two major qualities of your life. They will be the most important factors in your life, food and sleep. If your energies are dominant in your Swadhisthana, which is located just above your genital organ, here you will be a pleasure seeker. Pleasure does not necessarily 